Hi there, today's exercise is going to be a high intensity interval training wherein you're going to build total body strength and cardio endurance. So we have four main movements for today and you're going to do each movement for 20 seconds with a 10 second window to recover before we get into the next exercise. So if you're ready, let's get started. So we're going to do our inchworm to plank. Bring your feet hip width apart, reach the arms up. Time starts now. You're going to move your hands down, crawl your way forward in a plank, and then move back. So as many as you can for a total of 20 seconds. And what you want to look out for here is that the belly shouldn't be drooping down on the floor like this when you get into plank. So keep the arms steady and strong. Keep the body lengthened. Good. Continue to breathe here. Last five seconds here. Crawling forward. This really strengthens the legs, the upper body, and tones down through the core. Last one. And move back. Good. And then you have a 10 second window here to rest. So let's just bring the belly down on the floor and get ready for the next, which is your Superman's with lateral raises. Okay? So when you're ready, in three, two, one, you're going to extend your arms forward, bend through the elbows, lift up through the chest. Good. For 20 seconds, as many as you can, continue to bend the elbows all the way to the back, lifting the forehead, the chest away from the ground. Whew. So we're targeting here your shoulders, opening them up also through the chest as you lift away from the floor, squeezing in through the back of the shoulder blades. Feel like there's a pencil in between and you can't drop it. Last five. Continue to breathe. Four, lift up higher. Three, last two, and one. All right, rest. So you're gonna feel that a lot on the shoulders. And we're gonna have a 10 second window here to rest. So for the next pose, what you're gonna do is a loaded beast to a front step. So as we go there, bring your knees out wide, tuck your toes behind you and then lift your knees off the ground an inch. You're going to step the right foot outside your right hand, right hand forward, step it back, and then go through the other side. And then you can go fast with this, as many as you can for 20 seconds. And we're targeting here the strength of the legs, also opening up through the hips, targeting through your psoas. And you wanna keep your hand close to you, this is called attack hand. Good. And find a bit of momentum here as you step forward and back. Last five, four, three, two. Getting that sweat in. And last one out. All right, you have a 10 second window here. So let's get ready for the last pose, which is a side kick through. So I'm already getting uh, out of breath here, right? So you're gonna tuck your toes, lift your knees off the floor, engage here through the core. And what you're gonna do is extend your right leg to the side, step it back, and then left leg to the side. So this trains your stability for the body. We're doing this for 20 seconds again. Keep breathing. Stabilize through the shoulders. Feel that extension on the leg. And if you want to go quicker with this, you can add a jump. So hopping from one foot to the other while your hand extends. So feel that length on your side of the body and through the arms. <laughs> Continue to breathe. Maybe smile if that helps. Last five, four, three. Point your toes to Last and one. <sighs> so feel free to do that for four minutes with eight intervals. Again, we have 20 seconds of doing the movement with a 10 second window to recover and rest before moving on to the next exercise. I hope you guys enjoyed today's workout and see you soon.